All right, y'all. What is going on, Smokey J Gang? We is back with another one, and this is gay people asking me stuff about church. Y'all already know church a fool with it already. So on that note, let's go on and get into it. They have a question, I have an answer. Why is my sexuality a lifestyle? I don't call your sexuality nothing. I don't know you. Why do you call it a lifestyle? I don't know you either. Like choosing to wear a dress? He lives by the beach. That's so they asking him questions why you call my sex sexuality a lifestyle. And church right. Like, I don't know you. I don't know you either. Like, you know what I'm saying? And now, I understand if I know you and, and you know what I'm saying, and you a close friend or a family member or something like that. You know what I'm saying? But he don't know these people. Straight up. That's his lifestyle. So your sexuality is a vacation spot? I don't understand. It's not really a lifestyle. It's just my life. Yeah, but it's a bunch of shit that has nothing to do with me, so I don't care. Why is it that when you find out that I'm gay, you think that I want you? Well, if I know you're gay, then I would assume that you're into gay guys. And if you know I'm straight, then why? I wouldn't think that. I'm not gay. Standards, first of all. Everyone has a type. You might not be their type. Well, yeah. Of course, uh, I'm not their type. I like titties. Don't flatter yourself. <laughs> Your questions suck ass. Why are you so worried about how I'm going to have kids? What? You think straight people just walk around like, hmm, look at that gay person over there. I wonder how they're going to have kids. Got my own shit. Facts. Like, they don't do that. Like, a straight person wonder how a gay person going to have kids. Like, no. You have, you can have kids many different ways nowadays. It's 2020. Like, you have, you have kids if you gay. And you want to have kids, however you have kids, it's your way of having kids. Straight up. That's church. That's all church land you know. Like, straight up. Get going on, okay? I'm not worried about if you're going to have babies or not. Like, what the fuck? If anybody's wondered, like, hmm, I wonder if they're going to have babies because they're gay. Somebody's doing that. They're, they got too much fucking time on their hands. Why does it matter if I'm going to have kids or not? It don't. Technically, the world is overpopulated, and me not reproducing is helping you out. You really trying to turn your, your, your gayness into, like, a superpower? Like, okay, we get it. You, you have sex with other women. Who cares? It doesn't mean you're like, hello, I am, I am here. I am lesbian woman, and I, I, my non-reproduction is saving the ozone layer. Me being gay saves your life. Oh, yeah. Bow to the gay women. They're like this gay lesbian superhero fucking underlayer in Alaska somewhere that has a bunch of glowy crystals. I got like a fucking ring like the Green Lantern and y'all meet up somewhere. Oh, Janice, is your ring dinging? Mine is. Let's go to the crystal. <laughs> and, uh, but he, he got facts right there. That's facts. Straight up. Like, you know what I'm saying? You do whatever you want to. You know what I'm saying? And it's a lot of, I wouldn't say a lot of problems. With the lesbian community, whatever they want to call it, but they make themselves. Well, why you gotta say this and that? You know about me being gay, and you know if a person don't know you, they ain't gonna ask all that. They might look at you a certain way when you out in public or when you with that person that you with. Yeah, you gonna always get looked a certain way, but. You know what I'm saying? If they don't know you, they ain't finna ask these type of questions. Straight up. Cave, why are we going to the crystal cave? Is there something wrong? We haven't been gay enough today. We have to go be mega gay with all the other superhero or lesbians. If I want to have kids, um, I'm pretty sure I can figure it out. Well, it's not a fucking riddle. You just, you know, be a decent member of society and go adopt a kid. Like, the fuck? Thanks. Dude, real shit, I bet the gay community watched these questions and was like, we don't ask shit like that. Facts. We don't, and and I'm a person that that like female. I'm a female, and I like females. Like I don't ask shit like this. I don't ask questions like this. Straight up, like they're just crazy for real. Why do you feel the need to ask who's the man and who's the woman in the relationship? Okay. Um. I don't see any straight dude asking gay dudes 
which one is the man? I don't think we want to even know that. That's 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 really none of our business. Trust me. Last I checked, we were both women. That's why we're together. Both have lady parts. As far as two chicks, uh, no offense, but we can kind of tell which one is the more dominant yeah. one when we Anybody look sometimes, can tell. unless you are both Just girly. Look at a person and then if a guy's tell. asking you that, he's probably trying to like, you know, be like, hey, are y'all like down for stuff? That's probably what he's doing. Hey, don't take no advice on lesbians from me. I obviously don't know shit. Why do you get offended when people ask you if you're gay? I don't get offended. I'm just wondering why in the fuck you asking me that. Why would you be offended that yes. someone thinks you're gay? I, I, like I said, I don't get offended. I just kind of <laughs> look down and see what I'm wearing just to kind of like evaluate myself. I don't get offended when people think I'm straight. Okay, do you want a cookie? <laughs> How does it feel to be accurately represented in everything? Uh, by, uh sorry. Uh, by the look on your face, I, I think you're just trying to be an asshole. I, I'm not really sure. But as far as your question, you're going to have to elaborate. I don't know what the fuck that means. Every single show and film ever. Why is your definition of diversity a gay white man? Okay, I'm starting to get confused on these questions. Okay, so let me get this straight. You're mad because there's not enough gay people on TV. I don't think gay people are asking these questions. I think these people are just... Uh, yep, straight just, up. I don't know what they are. They Dude, there's shows from a hell a long time ago. They ain't. This got to be... This is why they ask this question. The question. The people is on TV asking him this. Re in reality, in real life, you're not going to see a gay person asking these questions. Straight up. I'm just being real. They have gay people in them. Friends had gay people in them. Uh, uh, Queer Eye for the Straight Guy. I'm, I'm sure that's a gay show. It sounds pretty gay. How dare you call that show gay? It is gay. It, it's called Queer Eye for the Straight Guy. Fuck, Will and Grace. Modern Family. I'm not even gay and I can name you gay shows, bro. Yes. I can't think of anyone who reminds me of me. Uh, you remind me of Drake when he was on Degrassi. The most that I had was Buffy. And she was straight. I was taking more of like Daria. The other one would probably be the closest representation of a young gay Asian. Okay, no, rice gum is a is a young gay Asian. Why is it that you have such a large dating pool, but still a really high divorce rate? Well, probably because there's way more married straight people than there are married gay people. Yeah, Duh. it is. Because hmm? it just it's, got it's legalized real about two, three it's years ago. Okay, as a straight guy, married. like a really straight guy, I'm here to tell you right now. What makes you think that I'm just going to show up to your wedding, as you call it, gay wedding, and just like have a pitchfork like, hell no, we don't like your kind around here. I couldn't care any less about a random person getting married that I don't know. Why would I care about that? Why do you have to call it a gay wedding? It's just a wedding. It's just a wedding. Who the fuck says that? Hey, did you hear about fucking Lisa and Samantha's gay wedding? <laughs> it's so gay. Uh, dude, oh, I know. It's because yeah. they're both girls. Is it just so you can charge us more? If two black people were getting married... Would you call it a black wedding? Okay, so what's the point of your fucking video? Because yes. it sounds like you're making all straight people out to be like booger-eating fucking eight-year-olds. I mean, let's be real. Have you ever heard somebody go, yeah, I'm going to this wedding. It's black. It's a black wedding. Why do you try to set us up with the very next gay person you see? Well, as a straight guy with all straight friends, I, I've never had to set up, I don't know, a, a fucking uh, a homosexual rendezvous. It's, it hasn't been a part of my schedule. I don't try to set you up with the other straight guy I know. Well, if I'm straight, wouldn't you, like, try to get a girl to go on a date with me and not another straight guy? <laughs> that's that's oh. still gay on your part. We have Tinder or Grindr or... What, what do you gay ladies use? Hey, pick me! I know something that you can use. Oh. Sometimes it does like this. Yeah, one of those. Trying to travel these things. Right. Like they, these people are crazy, man. Asking weird ass stuff. In reality, you would not catch a gay person asking this type of stuff. Straight up. But uh, y'all already know I had to do a reaction to it. Y'all already know church crazy as ever. He gonna speak his mind straight up. But let me know what y'all think about that in the comment section. Y'all already know. Make sure you subscribe if you're new. Give it a like. And y'all can catch me in the next video. On that note, I'm out.